hello again friends welcome back to my channel god bless you so much for clicking on the video yet again today to hear what the lord would have us know my name is sharon today the lord is giving visions to some persons the lord is expanding your vision is opening your eyes to a whole lot of things that you need at this time to get to where he has promised you um this person i'm speaking to situations of life has blinded you to even good opportunities yes um, you have encountered many, 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 several um, ill locks, bad locks, disappointments, betrayals here and there. And um, it's, you kind of went back into yourself, like just disconnected yourself from a whole lot of persons, a whole lot of things. And um, by so doing, you have even ignored good opportunities that were staring you right in the face. You ignored Good opportunities or rather you just didn't see them you don't pay attention to them anymore you don't even expect them anymore but you are the person I have come for today you are about to see a vision you're about to receive an idea you're about to see an opportunity you're about to walk into an open door you are just about to see what you have not been seeing before because the Lord is opening your eyes to the opportunity that you need to be able to take care of yourself, progress your course, help your family, and impact your generation. So this one person I'm looking at right now, I'm speaking to, you're seeing me as I'm speaking, this is your word today. The Lord is giving you a vision, an idea, an opportunity that may have been around you all the while, but because of the situation you were, you were in, you kind of locked yourself away from the possibility of ever having a change of story. You are that one person the Lord has remembered today and he's opening your eyes to see what you need to see to move your life forward and to help your generation. The scripture that came to mind was the story of Hagar. We know the story of Hagar, the wife <laughs> egyptian wife made wife of um, abraham it was written in the book of genesis 21 21 19 it says and god opened the eyes her eyes god opened her eyes and she saw a well of water and she went and filled the bottle with water and gave the lad drink gave her child drink this was the same Hagar who kept her child at a distance um, because the child was crying, kept her child at a distance and went to another distance and waited for the eventual thing to happen. Probably the child would die. And um, the Bible recorded that the Lord heard, heard the voice of the lad. The Lord heard the cry of the lad and the Lord came to Hagar and opened her eyes. The thing you are supposed to become in life is important to God. The thing you are created to be in life is important to God. He's going to open your eyes to the opportunity, the direction, the connection that will help you birth that thing or grow that thing or, or better still impact your generation. I don't know who I'm speaking to. I don't know how this affects you. I don't know in what department or what section of your life this applies to. But to this one person, the Lord is giving you vision, ideas, direction, connections, open doors, something that will move you from where you are right now to where you should be and change your life forever. You may have heard it many times. Yes, but faith comes by hearing, hearing and hearing by the word of God. I pray today as you've heard this again, have faith and God will bring it to pass in your life. He said to do this, believe him at his word. I pray I'll meet you again in my next video, friends. Bye-bye.